कैलकुलेट द जेड पैरामीटर्स फॉर द सर्किट इन फिगर सोल्यूशन एज वी कैन सी इट इज अ पाई नेटवर्क सो फर्स्ट वी हैव टू कन्वर्ट दिस पाई नेटवर्क इन टू इट्स इक्विवेलेंट टी नेटवर्क आफ्टर दैट वी कैन इजीली फाइंड दी जेड पैरामीटर्स सो टू कन्वर्ट दिस पाई नेटवर्क टू टी नेटवर्क अगेन वी विल रिड्रॉ दिस Our T network will be look like this. So here, let's say this is Z A. This is Z B, and this is Z C. Now. there is a formula to convert pi to t network or we can say this forms a delta network and we have to convert it into its equivalent star network so to convert delta to star z a is equal to this 12 multiplied by j 10 so 12 multiplied by j 10 divided by 12 plus J10 plus minus J5, so 12 plus J10 plus minus J5. So if we simplify this, we have to put calculator in complex mode. So mode then two, then 12 multiplied by I into 10 divided by 12 plus I into ten, then plus in bracket minus I into pi bracket close. So this will be three point pi pi u. Three point pi pi u plus plus J eight point pi u two. Eight point pi u two. This is the value for Z A. Then, same for Z B. The formula to calculate Z B is Z B is equal to this value twelve over multiplied by minus J five. So twelve multiplied by minus J five divided by same value that that is twelve plus J ten plus minus J five. Just we have to change the numerator. So here, twelve multiplied by in bracket minus i into pi u. Denominator denominator will be same. So it is minus one point seven seven minus one point seven seven. Then minus j minus j four point two six. This is the value for z b. Now z c z c is equal to here. This is z c. So j ten multiplied by minus j five. J ten multiplied by minus j Pi u divided by denominator will be same. That is twelve plus j ten plus minus j pi u. Now this will be i into ten multiplied by minus i into pi u bracket close. So this will be my three point five five, three point five five, then minus minus j one point four seven. So this is the value for that c. Now again we will redraw the network. 
Now this time this will be in T form or we can say in star form. So here it will look like this. So here this will be our ZA, ZB and ZC. This is ZA, this is ZB and this is ZC. Now we have to find Z parameters for this two port network. So we can easily find Z parameter using the formula Z11 is equal to ZA plus ZB. Then Z12 is equal to Z21 is equal to ZB. Then Z22 is equal to ZB plus ZC or ZC plus ZB. Now we will simply substitute all the values of ZA and ZB and ZC. So ZA is this. Then plus ZB. ZB is this value. This will be our ZB. We will write it directly in bracket minus 1.717 then minus J 4.26 bracket close. Then next is Z12. Z12 is equal to ZB. The value for ZB is again same. This is our ZB. Then ZC plus ZB. So ZC is this value. This is our ZC. Then again ZB. So ZB is this value. Here this will be plus and this will be in bracket. Now we will simplify all the values and we will get the value of Z11. So Z11 will be equal to 3.55 3.55 plus I into 8.52 then plus in bracket minus 1.5 77 then minus i into 4.26 bracket close and it is equal to 1.78 1.78 then plus 4. Point plus j 4.26 this is the value for z11 and since it is impedance so its unit will be ohm then Z12 is equal to Z21. Z12 is equal to Z21 is equal to same value that is minus 1.77 minus J 4.26. Again its unit will be ohm. Then Z22. Z22 is equal to this value 3.55 minus I into 1.47 then plus in bracket minus 1.77 minus i into 4.26 bracket close so it is 1.78 1.78 then minus 5.73 into j on here this will be j Again, its unit will be Ohm. We can also write this in impedance matrix form. So it will be, this will be impedance. The impedance matrix is given as Z11, Z12, Z21 and Z22.
Z11 is 1.78 plus J 4.26 then Z12 is minus 1.77 minus J 4.26 same value for Z21 the value for Z22 is this value can directly copy from here and its unit will be ohm since it is impedance so its unit will be ohm what we have to find in the question we have to calculate the Z parameters so here this is the Z parameter or impedance parameter. So, this is our final answer.